Hey there, y'all. I hope you're having a good day today. I just took some coffee and tea bag dyed papers out of my little box. This is a progressive project. So the way this goes is I just put these pieces of junk mail into uh, a cardboard box. You know how you get like... Um, Look at that. Isn't that just gorgeous? We buy 12 packs of dog food, you know, in the cans. And the carton that they are stacked in is what I use to tea dye and coffee dye. So basically, I just take my tea bags and coffee filters, place them on top of papers in the box and set them outside and this is what we get and I just really really am happy with this batch of papers I think it's so much fun to create things that are very simple you know very easy to do not complex and you use your tea bags and coffee filters in a creative way after I'm done dyeing these papers I compost the coffee grounds and the tea grounds and the coffee filters and the coffee bags um, I mean the tea bags so you really get a nice progression. You're recycling like to the hilt, you know. I'm going to leave that one on top. This is my favorite, man. That one's pretty. So create ways to do progressive art. It's really a lot of fun. And it's fun to complete the project. It's almost like throwing pottery and putting the pottery in the kiln and then you never know exactly what's going to happen after it's pulled out so you get this delightful surprise. Okay y'all, thanks for hanging out. See you later. Bye.